Here is a new attraction center of tourism, the Eastern Black Sea. Here is the land where the historical Silk Road for centuries crossed the mountains, plateaus, and met the sea. A unique nature with its snowy mountains, moist forests, lovely pastures, enthusiastic people, sea, and rushing streams, which is waiting to be rediscovered here. According to the legend of the Argonauts, the crew of the ship Argo sailed to the treacherous waters of the Black Sea, which they called the Hospitable Sea. Having ventured out in search of the Golden Fleece, they first took to the shore of the land of the Amazons, today's Ordu. Here is Jason Point, the place where the Golden Fleece legend took place. The ruins on Jason Point take you on a journey through the centuries. Jason Church, the only structure standing, is like a monument to loneliness under the clouds and rain the sky has scattered here. This legendary peninsula is a place of sanctuaries dedicated to Jason and in which sailors prayed before sailing. Festivals and competitions take place every year, and colorful kites embellish the sky on this delicate peninsula where sunset and sunrise can be viewed 320 days a year. The echo of ancient times still reverberates on Girisun Island, as do the cries of seagulls. Here is the only island that is inhabitable on the Black Sea. According to legend, Hercules, joining the Argonauts' quest for the Golden Fleece, lands on Girisun Island and fights the Stymphalian birds, which ate human flesh. Furthermore, the Amazons, the famed female warriors, used Girisun Island as their base camp. Hospitable Island is also a stopover for migrating birds. Churches and mosques are always an invitation for eternal unity and fellowship in the Black Sea. Sumela Monastery, the mysterious black pearl that is set on cliffs. The hidden temple that takes one back centuries in its every single stone with every single relief. A cool wind whispers history in the Black Sea Karaja Cave. All the light elicits a festivity of color. Both contentment and relaxation are possible in this rarely seen beauty. The green face of the Alpine Black Sea in Trabzon, Uzungu, sweeping like a deep green eternity in the Ladin forest, plus its hidden island that is rediscovered each time Zundu is viewed. Trees turn white and snow flowers bloom on boughs when winter comes. Though its name is the Black Sea, inside it, it is not black. Quite the contrary, it is an array of bright colors. All the purity and mystery of life is hidden inside the Black Sea.
Ovid Mountain, whose summit reaches to the clouds. Four seasons exist all together on its peaks. The summit lake sets on the beautiful throne of the mountain. The Kachkarlar's generous queen blinks at Yedigüller through the snow. Seven lakes that are connected together and clouds that almost touch the ground. Hearts are rejoined in the mountains and sea every morning on the Black Sea. In the Kachkarlar range, life turns snow white. Our excitement merges with the snow. The name of this thrill is Heliski. same thrill when you are rafting on rivers which are fed and overflow with snow and climb over the roughest waves with your canoe. Borchka, Karagul, nature's breath in the Black Sea. The magnificent wealth of flora. Old trees, each one a natural monument. Plus, the relaxing sound of rain that joins the forest. whispers the history of humanity in the world's second longest cave, Chal Cave. In the Black Sea, a new wind blows from the world's second biggest canyon. Here is Jehennem Derese Canyon that opens to the Ardanuch River. Here, beyond very narrow, rocky, vertical pathways and cliffs, here is the melody of all Black Sea moments that are entwined with the wind's call. Waterfalls are set on water's beautiful throne in the Black Sea. There, water and the Kyrgyz legend are told by Panovit and Tomara waterfall that streams foaming as white as milk. Sounds of babbling in the Black Sea waterfalls are an excitement of life. Waters babble as if they were singing their best song ever towards the hospitable sea. Sophia that witnesses the Black Sea's multicultural history. 
It watches newcomers with its tower that rises close by and welcomes its guests with its magnificence and mystery in every detail. Black Sea, Shafshat Karagur, Cyprinus and Aquarium Fish, the booming of spruce and pine forests that cover Karagur all around. Four seasons' colors become palms and flow into the Karagur with rain. place where snow and dance, skiing and passion meet. Zigana and Atabare Ski Resort, providing entertainment with the footprints of the Silk Road at 2,000 meters. Camanches, or black sea lyres, vocalize the harmony of mountain, sea, and forest. The charm of history tempts you once again in the houses of the Black Sea. The beautiful wooden houses that are built without using a single nail, in fact are nailed through wood, and are very hospitable with the beautiful people that are as natural as these houses. City museums of the Black Sea's memory. All traces of hidden memory from antique monuments belonging to different eras of history, to stone rubbings, from old weapons to ancient coins, all are extant in these museums. Hands perform what the heart feels, and art, handmade copper, wooden objects, fabrics and carpets become part of life in the Black Sea. around the Black Sea are like sweet droplets that gather on the forehead of nature, that precess with great enthusiasm. Each one of them is a different Black Sea color. The lakes that are in the palms of the mountains, whose peaks reach to the clouds, Chakur Lake, Limni Lake, and Yildiz Lake. that are set on vertical hills, on the shores of the Black Sea. Civilizations and the prophets of legend on the Black Sea from past to present. 
pearl drops that are sprinkled to the sea and mountains. Heaven on Earth, the Eider Flatland, at the foot of the Kachkarlal, every single season is a festival. Water means life here. Many wounds recover in the healing waters. Churches and mosques are always an invitation to eternal unity and fellowship in the Black Sea. Mosques and churches facing times from centuries ago to the present, each and every one a monument to faith. up life in the Black Sea. Tea means labor and waiting with patience here. It is singing from the heart, loving from the heart. Black Sea acquires its color from tea, nut, cherry, and rosehip trees. Life is lived through all of these. Water is life's enthusiasm that babbles in waterfalls in the Black Sea. It flows into the hospitable sea as if it was singing life song. Bridges on which many lives have passed. Bridges that connect many lives. Bridges that lie from past to present without falling down. The mansion of Atatürk in Trabzon, with its architecture that mirrors beauty and delicacy with simplicity. Every single corner of it maintains ancient times.
The charm of the past tempts you again in the magnificent mansions of the Black Sea. Every single season is a time for enthusiasm and excitement in the flatlands. The joy of life is taken every summer and spring. With a substantial plant cover, forests and creeks, it is an undisturbed nature with hundreds of different kinds of flower. Maybe the Black Sea is the heaven of transitory life because of its colorful nature. Waters flow on their own and flowers bloom differently here. Clouds dance above meadows. Snow with its complete beauty when winter comes. Skis sliding down from the hills like snow. Songs that sound like snow and are sung as if to make them join into the booming of the mountains. The Plateau that babbles with endless plentifulness. The most delicious and unique honey is savored in Anzar. The taste of life is sweeter than honey here. Tables are cheered with the abundance of the Black Sea here. The taste of life still lingers. Another flavor at each meal. Tastes that are unforgettable, natural, and genuine. Friday prayer is performed by thousands at the open-air mosque Kadurga that is unequaled in the world. Friday is a new breath of life and a new call of resurrection to all the hearts along the entire Black Sea shore here. A cool wind begins singing the history of humanity through the valleys. Here is Santa Valley, an old village of miners. Houses, churches, and genuine stone masonry in the fountains of this antique city that are built totally of stone, whispering of the unfading beauty of that art quietly. Orta Mahale in Akchabad the living core of the Black Sea that keeps old-time neighborhoods alive, welcomes its guests standing with its delightful appearance. The Horon resumes when life flows with a seaweed rush. Secrets are revealed over and over in the hands. Both passion and excitement jumble with the Horon. Caucasian dances are an excitement that bring one from the peaks to the seas, 
one that releases the internal flow of life inside. Time here is the Black Sea. Journeys are made both by sea and mountain at the same time. All the bays sing the same songs. All the shores whisper in the winds of mountains and flatlands. The Black Sea and human are like loved ones who hug each other, experienced when traveled and seen. They are a colorful painting that mingles with the sounds and fogs and sometimes stirs up the heart. The song persists as long as the Black Sea is traveled and seen. <laughs> 